Manipur Assembly resolves to rename Imphal International Airport as Bir Tikendrajit International Airport. MPDA gas up to launch protest against undisclosed Naga Framework Agreement. And Home Minister Amit Shah reviews ongoing operations against Naxals. Hello, good evening, welcome to Times of Manipur. This is Haripriya Tongram giving you the news in details. In the first day of the 8th session of 11 Manipur Legislative Assembly, the House passed a resolution to rename the Imphal International Airport as Bir Tikendrajit International Airport. Leader of the House and Chief Minister N. Biren moved the resolution in the House. Opposition leader O. Ibobi and MLA of Nauria Pakhanglakpa S. Subhash Chandra observed the move before accepting, accepting it. Oibobi, on behalf of the opposition, supported the resolution while saying that the airport was upgraded to international airport during Congress regime. The former chief minister said that the then cabinet also took decision to change the airport name, but the move was halted due to election. MLA S. Subhash Chandra also supported the resolution but suggested that the name Tulihan should be kept intact in the new name of the airport. Later, Speaker Y. Kemchan brought up the resolution to rename the airport as Bir Tikendrajit International Airport, which was unanimously passed by the House. Imphal International Airport is the second international airport in the Northeast region after Guwahati. Meanwhile, Chief Minister Ian Biren tabled the Manipur Private Security Agency's Regulation Rules 2019 and the Annual Report of State Vigilance Commission for the year 2018-2019 in the House. The 10th Report of the Business Advisory Committee, 51st Report of the Controller and Auditor General of India for the year 2017, were tabled by Chairman of Committee on Public Account. Y. Sur Chandra, Chairman of Committee on Public Undertaking of India for the year 2017. K. Leshio tabled the 52nd Report on Access over Watered Grants and Charts Appropriation 2016 to 2017 and Member of Committee on Government Assurances. K. H. Joy Kisson tabled the 18th Report in the House. Biren, who is also the Finance in Charge, also proposed in the House to select seven members each for Committee on Public Accounts. Committee on Estimate and Committee on Public Undertakings. Meanwhile, the Manipur Assembly condoled the death of three members of the House and former Secretary of Manipur Legislative Assembly. The House gave obituary reference to former MLA of Hanglep Halkomang Haukip, former MLA of Chingai Dr. M. Horang, former MLA of, MLA of Saikot Constituency M. Chungkhasoi and former Secretary of Manipur Legislative Assembly a. Halim Chowdhury. Giving the obituary speech, House Leader CM N. Biren stated that Hal Komang Haukip was a true public leader. The former MLA who was also an MP work for the welfare and development of the state, he added. He also lauded Dr. M. Horam for his work, saying that he was a social worker, Tankul writer, professor and also a dean of Manipur University. Meanwhile, N. Biren also pressed the activities of M. Chung Kosai, who won the 7th Manipur Legislative Assembly on the ticket of Manipur State Congress Party. Chief Minister stated that A. Halim was a prominent leader among the Muslim community and was a good administrator. House members O. Ibobi Singh, S. Bira Kasim Washum, T. T. Haukip, T. N. Haukip, L. Laishio, K. Govindas, and A. K. Mirabai also took part in giving obituary reference. The opposition leader O. Ibubi remembered the three members of the House, saying that their demise is huge loss to the state. Ibubi also recalled work of former Assembly Secretary Chowdhury. Later, the members of the House observed a two-minute silence as a mark of respect to the departed three leaders and Assembly Secretary. Manipur People's Democratic Alliance, MPDA, has 
has geared up to launch protests against the secret Naga Framework Agreement, which was signed between the government of India and Anation IM on August 3, 2015. It may be noted that the centre had informed a parliamentary panel that it signed a framework agreement with the National Socialist Council of Nagaland, Isak Muiva, Anation IM, after it agreed on a settlement within the Indian Federation with a special status. Leaders of MPDA during a press meet at the office of Manipur People's Party, MPP, expressed discontentment over the ongoing undisclosed peace talks between their centre and NHN IM, which started in 1997. MPDA is made up of MPP, DPSP, TMC, RSP, RJSP, BSP, MPC and NCP. The alliance further informed the media that it submitted a memorandum on the issue to the Chief Minister yesterday. The memorandum urged the Manipur government to take a firm decision in the ongoing monsoon session of Manipur Assembly to safeguard Manipur against the Naga Framework Agreement, demand of Greater Nagaland, Supra State and Article 371A. MPP President O. Jogindra said the long-term demands raised by NHN IM might be in sight the contain of the framework agreement. The Naga outfit and its leader Muiva should not be allowed to distort territorial integrity of Manipur and that MPDA will fight and toot and nail against any move to harm the territorial integrity he pledged. <laughs> Aduga, Nagalengi, Nagalen Kakta the Senega, there are three hundred seventy one close A. Hanibus Nagalen Kakta the Senega, the Vadumba, Article Singamadu, Manipuda, Extent Tropa, Sumana Singma Semasi, the Widanava, Akwe Assembly Na, Sub Saba Warit, Ama Lobiraga, Mamaida Nagalen Assembly Na, nineteen eighty four da, nineteen ninety four da. Ati ati mangarak sum na makoy na low riba warab to adu mai na akoy dzu warab si matang matang lowi na ba akoy is mai na apil to jage Union Home Minister Amit Shah today review ongoing operation against nationals and development initiatives being undertaken in left wing extremism affected areas. Chief Minister Nitish Kumar, Navin Patniak, Yogi Adityanath, Kamal Nath, Raghuvar Das and Bupis Bakhal besides top police and civil officials of 10 Nexus affected states attended the meeting. Top officials of paramilitary forces and the Home Ministry also attended the meeting, the first of its kind after Sir Ajum Charles as Home Minister. The 10 Maui Sith states are Satisga, Jharkhand, Orissa, West Bengal, Bihar, Maharashtra, Telangana, Andhra Pradesh, Madhya Pradesh and Uttar Pradesh. According to Home Ministry statistic, 8,782 cases of natural violence were reported during 2009 to 2013 as against 4,969 during 2014 to 2018, a reduction of 43.4%. Bharti Gas Gohati based Bharti Gas, a venture of Srishti LPG bottling plant private limited, has launched its service brands at Hotel Mars Infal today. Distributor of the newly launched Bharti Gas, K. Navakeshwar explained that the newly launched service will provide benefits which other gas companies do not provide. He said loan for a new connecting 24 into 7 free delivery service and higher gas volume are some of the facilities given by the Bharti Gas. PL not a PL Gunda Yamna low level class B or class of Labising City loan system Tongan have loan system set in the Masagi Lupa would stock a learner Lupa listing manga so homes in the way we have a Vucina Lega the Bussi four times and Traga three times installment basis the Mazi Tiel Laga connection big in have. Can I go in the connection to the continuous service store? Tatrama to his man connection fulfilled to Horaba, or the trying to show a Tamado, say he moved with Tamado, conversion P. the Pilpigan. Well, we are heading to a short break. Stay tuned for more updates.
Welcome to Times of Manipur. This is Sanjaya Tongram giving you news in Hanana Fanglamba Gangla food ki products in Gimatakta and the products in Hibadi. Milky bowls, a somia mixture, amadi, a lubuji and a ching missing a si housek housek in the Mikate the Fangle. Kangla get another products in a si mayam so amutang maho yingbi. Kangla Salai Holdings Private Limited na, Labak Miam the Kanganjava. Salai Holdings Private Limited ki Honorable Chairman and Managing Director Dr. Narimbam Samarjit Singh Masa Hujja Hujik Business Trip ki Damakta Salai ki Overseas Company Singh Yeng Chinpa Kalo Nena Tungan Tungan Ba Pipeline Da Lai Riba Tungan Tungan Ba Country Singh Dita Natana India Amadi Maru Oina Nordis ki Oina Manipur Yau Na Paikhat Kadaba Mega Project Singh Adu ki Damakta Overseas Bank Singh Ka Stakeholder Oimena Bagi Maru Oiba Meeting Singh Yau Ba Amadi Meeting Singh Conduct Oba Sat Ki Bena Maram Oira Ga Tungan Tungan Ba Club CSO Lanai ki Furup ki Lining ki Amadi Culture ga Marile Na Ba Khudi Bagna Salai ki Lushing Purel oi bidi bana halakturi fao putang hai bining ba tham bining makhudimak ngai bina ba miyam da noluk chari noluk na hai jari ba board of directors salai holdings private limited welcome back one person was taped to death during a brawl that occurred at langthabal mantrikong awang lekai of imphal west today at around 12 30 pm the deceased has been identified as Kangabam Romes, also known as Nanao, as 37 years, son of Chorjit Romes, was allegedly murdered by Arambam Liman, as 37 years, son of A. Santabi from the Sam locality. Romes died on the way to the hospital, a report said. Local sources said Liman always roamed in the locality with a knife and has had case of biting people. United Living Trust Manipur House Delhi in association with Biakon IS organized a one-day students orientation come career counseling program on Be Educated, Be Empowered. 0 0.02 edition at Biakon IAS Model Town Metro Station, New Delhi yesterday. The main objective of the program was to make positive impact on the young generation in shaping their future, the trust said. Through this initiative, the trust has provided a platform to interact between young students, aspirants and achievers, it said. Professor of JNU, Dr. Bimol Akojam, Advocate Daksha Sarma, Executive Editor of India News, Dinesh Gautam and IAS Niras Kumar talk on various aspects of career goals and career options during the program. National awardee Momota Thaunauzam was accorded a warm reception by BJP Nambol Mandal yesterday at Nambol Bazar Community Hall. National Youth Award is conferred on young men and women on voluntary organizations every year in recognition of their outstanding works in the field of national development and welfare service. Every year, the award, the award is given to young persons in the age group 15 to 29 years in recognition of excellent works in the field of national development or social service. 20 young persons were given the National Youth Award 2016-2017 and Momota Thaunauzam was one of them. Momota is 19 years who is from a poor family background, is the daughter of Thaunauzam Ibomcha and T.H. Bashanti from Utlau Mayai Lekai under Nambul in Vishnupur district. She was conferred the National Youth Award 2016-2017 for her excellent work for betterment of society. Speaking on the occasion, Momota said she always wanted to dedicate her life for the welfare of the society. <laughs> Former Union Minister T.H. Chauba, President of BJP Nambol Mandal S. Brajamani, Vice President of BJP Manipur Pradesh T.H. Basanta, Chairperson of Nambol Municipal Council C.H. Basanta, Pradhan and former Pradhans of 
Nambol Assembly constituency also attended the program. Tihe Chauba Seat Momota is the first woman from Northeast to back the prestigious award, saying it was a proud moment for Utlo Mayailikai and also for the entire Nambol area. A meeting of Joint Action Committee on Lilong Constituency Road Development Committee was held at Lilong Mayai Lekai Ngango Bazaar to discuss the deteriorating condition of roads and other infrastructures in Muslim dominated Lilong Constituency of Thaubal District today. The JSC has been formed by Lilong Political Unified Link, Lipul, Halakyo, Icro Club Organization, and Myra Paibis. Several resolutions were adopted during the meet. JEC convener Muhammad Tajuddin read out the resolution which include pushing for fulfillment of all demands raised by the JEC, submitting the resolution to the local MLA for repair of Lilong Turil Ahanbi, Atau Kong Dam and Oinam Dam at the earliest possible. Moray civil society organizations have claimed that former chairman of Autonomous District Council Chandel Lukosai Joe has not connection whatsoever with the drug seizure case that took place in Imphal on June 19, 2019. The Moray civil society also warned that the houses and properties of the perpetrators and the drug owners will be declared for fit for tarnishing the image of Moray residents. It may be mentioned that Sian Jan Thang, his wife, Niang Kashun, Tung Kham Mung, Pao Shalian allies, Pao Pu of Gam Nong Vieng Mori and Nian Yen allies, Terry Sao, Fai Chang Vieng Mori, Ward number 3, are currently in judicial custody in connection with a drug case. Another quick break, but coming up, district level workshop on propagation of bamboo and its utilization held at Babupara Jiribam. More after the break. Manipur de Ihan Hanbo in a lumping but jewelry now. Market of Hungus Sana Mayam Sigi quality check to Bugi Kurong Java Pijari. Adomadongi Lajari was Sana the Yau River Eloy Amad Elements Kayagi Chang Marik Chumna. Accurate quality Amadi quantity Galoina Kangan Bangam Lagani. Lamjing but jewelry in a pijari but kudong chaba a silo biho, adongi sanadu, sing in a truck sing the high bogi ching nabadu, okan biyo. A kupa marol gidamak, lamjing but jewelry da links in biro. Lamjing but jewelry, good quality is our priority. Studio 11, India's favorite salon and spa, now at Infa. Our services are hair cut, hair straightening, global color, body spa, hair spa, waxing, threading, facial and treatment, hand and feet care, makeup. Body massage. Studio 11, Salon and Spa Infa. Look fabulous. Fitness World Building. Singzamay Matak Jong Tham Lekai, Infal West. Phone number. 0385-2440164 Welcome back. Jiriwang Forest Division under the funding from National Bamboo Mission and BM organized a district level workshop on propagation of bamboo and its utilization at PWD Guest House Babupara Jiribam today. Chairperson of Jiribam Municipal Council, JMC Jiribam Sangapam Santi Devi, District Forest Officer of Jiribam, CH Ibom Sa Singh, Honorary Wildlife, Wildlife Warden, Jiribam Haichra Jain Kumar Singh, and Assistant State Mission Director, NBM Manipur, and Somerin Rusia, the Dais as Chief Guest, President, and Guest of Honor, respectively. Chairperson Santi said, recognizing the abundant bamboo resource in the state, especially in Jiribam, one should take the advantage from such workshop. She further said, Jiribam has produced various bamboo products and fermented bamboo soot, food which are popular in the entire Northeast. <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
DFO CH Ibomsa said the workshop was held with a focus on raising awareness on bamboo and its products. Honorary Wildlife Warden of Jiribam H. Rajin Kumar Singh urged each and everyone to come forward and participate in such workshop to get the maximum benefit. A seven-day fisheries training program held at Naurem Mayailikai Nambol concluded today. The training was jointly organized by Panthoi B Farmer Club Naurem and ICICI Foundation. Chairperson of Nambol Municipal Council, Basanta Councillor of Ward No. 14, K.H. Sundari and nominated Councillor O. Satrajit and Project Manager of ICICI Foundation, Pungo Thong Tunjalian were the man attendees on the concluding day of the training. Project Manager of ICICI Foundation, Pungo Thong Tunjalian said that the training program aims to generate more income for the farmers. Tadiat gi program manungda akoy na maximum farmers sing sa benefit mahoy gi damak karamay na putok pa yaga niya dukhan ba nagi training si dahaw ba ni akoy gi hosikan di mi chani ga tara farmers sing training pang thokre akoy gi future plan da mi 2019-20 financial year manungda mi leasing ani gumba akoy na training pang thok pa ngam gani. The suspension of operations agreement signed between the Kuki Militant Outfits of Manipur and the center has been extended by six months, opening the way for more peaceful deliberations. The agreement on suspension of operations was signed between the center, Manipur government on one side, and the Kuki National Organization, KNO, and the United People's Front, UPF, on the other in 2018. A career counselling for Wusu players and their guardians for Bishnupur district was held at Ning Thokong with the principal aim to produce more medalists from Bishnupur district. The counselling was organised by Bishnupur district Wusu Association at Mangolgan B College, Ning Thokong. The counselling was also attended by former president of Amuku, Dr. Waimani Kuman, founder of International Kung Fu Kickboxing India, TH Norendro Association, Secretary TH Udochan, and Publicity Secretary Dr. H. Roman. Like the Aurakati, or do you like the Hari? I can't be angled at 45 degrees the Lepaga, and a Kichi Taragati, a chance to the Tasta Music, like the Aur. I don't know, like Hiragati, Sanaba Swinfani, Sanaba Parabala, and it's Marilyn or Pony. I don't know, I shanare, Hiraga, like the Toy of the Bear. ตัวจิตโกมินะทําปีกิฮาริกุสุกัมปัลซีตูเอลพาสตาอุตเบยาตุเนี่ยนะคุยบุอะคุยเนี่ยอีจันตานะนะบอกนะบอกนะคุยน
to block American companies from doing business with China. The yuan today declined to 7.1468 to the dollar, its weakest rate since January 2008. Chinese leaders have promised to avoid competitive devaluation to hold down export prices in the face of Trump tariff hikes. But regulators are trying to make the state control exchange more market oriented and investors jitters about the tariff war opposing the yuan lower. Trump said on Friday he was ordering American companies to stop dealing with China. He said later he was threatening to use emergency powers under a 1977 law that targets rock regimes, terrorists and drug traffickers. After making repeated offers for med mediation on the explosive Kashmir issue, U.S. President Donald Trump today said India and Pakistan can shut the issue out between themselves as he held a meeting with Prime Minister Narendra Modi on the sidelines of the G7 summit in France. Trump ceding to the fact that Kashmir is a bilateral issue is a big win for India as Pakistan has been trying to get global support after the government revoked special status for Jammu and Kashmir. All issues between India and Pakistan are bilateral in nature. That is why we don't bother any other country regarding them, Trump said, adding that Modi told him the situation in Kashmir is under control. And now let's move on newspaper headlines. The Sangai Express, Naga Flake Constitution Core Issues, NSN2 Center, International Drug Baron Hell, Drugs Worth Rupees 400 Crore Seas, Disclose Framework Agreement Details Force, Demands UCM, The People's Chronicle, Separate Flake Constitution Key to Solution, says NSN, Reaffirm Assembly Vote to Protect Territorial Integrity, says UCM, Stop Taking Central Projects for Granted, says Ibobi, Infall Free Press, Kuki Ting Tang Group alleges Federation of Homey Leaders of Wing NSN IM Morphis. Ukru police clarify there was no sidelining of rap complaint. International drug smuggler arrested with 40 lakh WI tablets worth rupees 400 crore. Customs division also sees 1 lakh WI tablet worth rupees 10 crore. BJP's policy is not only divide and rule, but also divide and ruin, says Gai Khangam. The morning bell. Drugs worth rupees 400 crore sees. Drug Lord from Myanmar, three smugglers nap. UCM urges Manipur Legislative Assembly to reaffirm stand to protect integrity. Government's schemes to reach interior places, says Minister Jayanta Kumar. Tribes of Federation of Homi Mosley Kuki misrepresented by Naga leaders, says Kuki Think Tank. Manipur Mail, WY Tablet worth rupees 410 crore, says by Tobal Police. Lok Ayutyo will work for public, says Chairperson. Before we close, let's see the top stories once again. Top stories Manipur Assembly resolves to rename Imphal International Airport as Bir Tikendrajit International Airport. MPDA gas up to launch protest against undisclosed Naga Framework Agreement. And Home Minister Amit Shah reviews ongoing operations against Naxals. That's all for the moment. Thank you very much for joining us and keep watching Times of Manipur News Update.